Hi guys, I'm going to show you how to upload a video to Google Drive and share it with your friend or your colleague, whoever you want to share it with. Now, the first thing you want to do is make sure that you are logged into Google. As you can see to the right top here, I am logged in right there. And then make sure you are in the folder you want to upload your video to. If you don't have a folder, that's fine. If you just upload it, it's just going to go into your Google Drive and you can locate it there. But in this instance, I am uploading it into the BizCron folder. So if you do want to put this in a folder, create a folder. And then um, how to do that is very simple. You just do a folder, a new folder right there, and then you name the folder. Now to upload the video is very, very uh, simple as well. Once I'm in the folder wherever I want to upload the video to, what I then have to do again is go to new to the left right here, the plus sign, the new plus sign to the left. Now, what I'm simply uploading is a file, right? I am uploading a file. So I'm going to click file upload. And when I do that, the hope is that my file shows, you know, my, uh, fo my uh, folder that I want to upload from shows right and so here i'm just going to upload a video here winter trees short and what you will then notice is to the bottom right here it is uploading and it says less than a minute left now this is a short video this is a short video if you have a longer video you might have to wait a while because it will definitely be a larger file if you also have like a large file um you might also have to wait so you just want to make sure you're looking to the bottom right here and looking to as you can see the circle when every time i put a, the mouse on it, it shows the x but i'm going to take it off and you can see as that circle is going around it's telling you pretty much the rate at which the video is uploading so when that circle is complete that shows that your video has uploaded so right now we are just waiting but again this is a short one so, I mean, this gives you an idea. It also depends on your internet connectivity. So if you are on a high speed internet, of course, it's going to load faster. But if your internet is not as fast, you might not be able to load as quickly. So those factors play into it. Just keep that in mind when you're doing that. Now, what's happened here, as you see, we now see the check mark at the bottom that says complete. And you could also see it says one upload complete. Right. So now what we want to then do is we have the video in here. I mean, what we what you need to realize, like, first of all, this is awesome. We have uploaded the video and it's in here and now we want to share it. Right. OK. So if you want to share it, what you want to do then is go to the video itself and hit more actions. You see these three dots here. Once you hit more actions, it pops up. And what then you can do, as you can see, is share. And in this instance, we want to share with a friend of ours. Now, I'm hoping that your friend has an email address, right? <laughs> All right. So once you click share, what you can then do is send this to the person you want to. OK, now we're going to share this with info at bizcrownm.com. You see, as you can see that we pick that. That's the email. So let's say this is your friend and you want them to be an editor. You can choose that right here. If you that just want them to comment on it, you could choose that right here. If you want them just to be able to view it and not to be able to make changes, you will pick them as a viewer. But those are the three options you have to send to your friend, as you can see. So if you do want them to edit it, though, you would click editor. And that typically is the default, as you can see here. And what you can then do is just type your message in here. Check it out. And all you have to then do is click send. Now, once you click send, the email address receives that. And it says right here, info at Bizcron M is external to Bizcron Media who owns the item. This organization encourages caution when sharing externally. All you have to then do is just click share anyway, because it's just not in the organization. That's why it's doing that. Now, this has gone to your friend's email. And that's how you can simply upload a Google Drive video or a video, I should say, to Google Drive and then share with your friend. Now, another way you can also do this again is to go back to the three dots because there's another way you can also share this. Go back to the three dots right here. 
and then go to share as you can see it share again right here but in this instance instead of clicking the share button we are going to copy the link and what this does is it just copies the link for you and you can see to the bottom here it says link copied well when you've done that what happens is anywhere you go and you just paste that link as you can see here it's going to show the video it's going to show the file as you can see here it's still uh taking longer than expected to process the video as you can see here but the video is there you can actually download it but this is the file to the video so in this instance what you can then do is then just go to a, your email right go to an email or even a text message if you have access to that go to that and then send that link send this link that we just copied right here and then send it via email to uh, your friend now what will happen is if your friend has access to it they will be able to open it also if it is open if it's just a link that's open to anybody on the web to be able to view it your friend will be able to view it too however if it's restricted if you have not given access to your friend then you might just get a notice um, that says this person wants to access this file do you want to grant access to that person via email that's typically how it works but that's how you can actually just copy this link right here and then share it with your friend because at times you might just want to send a text message and not via email but whether you do it via email or text this is a very very simple way to do it so these those are the two options you can either either share it and then add in their email and then give them the permissions that they they need to be able to view the document or you could just copy the link put it in an email or a text send it to them and they will then will be able to access it once they have the access to be able to view it but that's how you can upload a video to google drive and then share it with your friend i hope this was helpful if it is like the video and also subscribe to our channel so you can continue to see content that just makes life easier for you till next time take care